and we're back on the Girls Rule, Boys Rule show. Yeah. And I am here with the very handsome, very sexy, very wow. sensual Robbie Nova. This is all right. And he's a Virgo, ladies. Virgo. So yeah. can I just tell you one thing about Virgos? What? Virgos like to eat, are known to like to eat, if you know what eat I mean. What? I, I don't say eat. I think we like to tell secrets between the thighs of women. <laughs> I like that. I think like okay, that. so Virgos like to tell secrets. A lot of secrets. Lots of secrets. Yes. In secret places. Right. Right? <laughs> right Right between the thighs. All right. So, tell us a little bit about yourself. Promote yourself. Do what you uh, gotta do. All right, so um, I, I like the highlights of this year. So, can I just talk about this year? Yeah, of course. I was on a, uh, a lead single off an album called The Day After Tomorrow, which was um, Mano's Atlantic Records album. Um, I performed at the White House this year. Uh, I did a record with 50 Cent this year. Uh, I performed at Summer Jam this year. Um, what else we got? We got one of my songs that we released on um, on YouTube called Rodeo that did over 420,000 views independently this year. And um, I'm also going to say that or we can tell them the news about Monday. No, no. Go right tell ahead, them right baby. now. I did the theme song for uh, Jim Jones and Chrissy new reality show that, that is Monday at 9.30. On 930 VH1. On VH1, yeah. That is huge. Look That's at, just this year. How old are you? I'm 26, 27. Damn, 30. you're mad young. I'm, I'm out here. You're I'm young. old enough to get in trouble and then young enough not to get... Do you have children? Uh, no, not yet. He's the winner. <laughs> He's the winner, ladies. <laughs> because I don't have kids. <laughs> No, because, you know... I'm just focused. We grinding. We working hard. And you know what I'm saying? We just trying to take advantage of our opportunities. So how old were you when you first started singing? Like, how, when did you know that this was a passion? How long have you been in this mm. industry? Because it's I'm sure it's taking you a while to get where you yeah, are absolutely. now. Yeah, absolutely. It I, doesn't come overnight. Nah. I, I started... I started in church because my grandmother was like a choir director mm -hmm. and there were so many cousins. She had so many grandkids that she just put us together. So I didn't know I wanted to be a singer then. I learned to play the drums to get out the choir. Uh -huh. So um, oh, so you weren't even singing in the choir? No, nah, I, I had to sing in it, but she started getting strict like with the rehearsals and all yeah, that. I'm yeah. like, yo, you know what? <laughs> this, this authority thing, I ain't good with it. So um, I, I learned to play the drums or whatever. And then, you know, music always been around my family. My mom used to play it every time I went in the house. So, you know, me just starting, like, I used to um, mimic, like, I used to mimic Donnell Jones. I'm not saying I'm gone, but I. Uh -huh. And people used to be like, yo, you got a good voice. Everybody. Oh, wow. <laughs> I love that song so much. So <laughs> I, I used to do that. And, you know, the girls was like, yo, you, you got a, you, you know, a, a voice. Nice so, voice. you know, in 2000, I, I just made up my mind. This is what I wanted to do from here on out. And I, I just put 110. So you've been just energy. grinding it out. Yeah, right. grinding it. I had to deal with Akon. So I knew I was good enough to get signed. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That situation didn't work out. So, you know, we bounced back. Like I said, this year has been just amazing. Yeah, just staying consistent with my grind. So. Yeah. I've noticed that, like, people who really make it, um, it takes a while. Yeah, it does. It doesn't, it, like, it It takes a long, long time. Like, I was, um, one of my favorite rappers right now is French Montana. Right. And I was watching, like, because he started doing, you know, these uh, DVDs with mm -hmm. the Coke Boys. Yeah. And I was watching his some of his past videos where he's, like, scrawny and, like, <laughs> you know, like, with the big T-shirts. It was so yeah. long ago. But, It'd you know, like now that. he's on top. But it you know, you would think he just came out of nowhere, but he didn't. It's, they, been it's a grind. always like that. When, when it start rolling, it rolls fast. But that grind before that is hell. I know. But it's all good. You got to appreciate that because you learn as you go. Yeah, I know a lot of Virgos who are in the music industry. You guys yeah. are like really We running it. Diligent. Beyonce, uh, Michael Jackson, Nas, Swiss Beats. Red Nano, Cafe. Red Cafe. So, you know, there's a lot of talented Virgos yeah, definitely in the uh, industry. There is definitely so. a lot of talented Virgos. We live. We live. Okay, yeah. so um, what we're going to do is we you have this music video. Right. So we're going to get into this video so we could check it out. Ladies, mm -hmm. feast yourself on some eye candy. This is the rodeo song. This yeah. is the song that did 420 views. I couldn't neglect it, so we went back and did a nice little video for it. And I hope you enjoy it. Yeah. yeah. Okay, let's get into that video.
like a rodeo up and down and around we go every time we try to move forward we come right back round full circle girl this love's like a rodeo up and down and around we go every time we try to move forward we come right back round full circle Something oh my like god i love it you know what i'm saying woohoo i Love know. it Okay, can we just do, can you right. serenade us for like just one more second? <laughs> just one more. All right. Um, to do a different song. Do something that really like, what, think of a song right now that will <laughs> automatically make every girl in this studio wet their panties. I want to make love. Get the kissing on your body. Then I'm turning on your faucet. Get you at it in tsunami. Make love. That deep passion and love, girl. My body on yours. Then we do it. I'm talking about that grown shit. Turning off your phone shit. Early in the morning. Still having you moaning, moaning. So hold on and squeeze tight and don't let it go. Me love to me, just makes me love to me. Something like that. <laughs> <laughs> Something like that. Robbie Nova in the building right now. Something like that. I love it. You right. are so talented. Yeah, I play piano, I play drums, I produce, I write. I do you a whole like bunch of stuff. stimulated me right now. I definitely got a Interesting. little. Interesting. Yeah, a little moisture. You got a couple a of secrets I want to tell you. You know, down there, definitely. I'm not gonna even front, you know, keeping it 100, you know. That's all right, ain't nothing wrong with that. <laughs> ain't nothing wrong with that. <coughs> all right, so before we go, right, <coughs> tell them your Twitter, everything. Uh, Twitter is Robbie Nova PK. Go on YouTube, Robbie Nova TV. Please check that out, you know what I'm saying, and definitely look out for that. Uh, that, that VH1 next Monday coming up, 9:30. Chrissy and Mr. Jones show. I did the theme song for that. And that's going to play every time that show come on. So we're looking huge. forward to that. Yeah, that's great. That's, that's so great. That's so great. Okay, perfect. So we're yeah. going to um, have DJ Fuji take it away. And don't leave because Robbie Nova is going to stick around and he's going to go over the sex tips of the week with us All right. and give his two cents on everything. And DJ Fuji, I hope you do the same, baby. <laughs> All right. Take it away, honey bun.